All new at 10 o'clock, CBS News Texas has obtained some disturbing video that shows racism on full display in a classroom full of students. J.D. Miles spoke to some of those students tonight in Grand Prairie who wonder if they're welcome at their own school. With 15 academies tailored to give career-focused students professional training in more than a dozen fields of study, John Dabisky Career High School in Grand Prairie is one of the district's finest achievements. What does it say? It makes watching this all the more difficult to understand. It says Sometime last week, a video was posted showing as many as a half dozen students in a Dabisky High School classroom saying the N-word out loud in front of other students. And, I and writing the slur on a banner with the word hate next to it, as well as spelling it. And repeating it several times during the 36 second clip. I feel like uh, we're owed an apology. We spoke to five black students outside the school today who asked us not to show their faces or use their names. They say what they saw in the video was behavior that's all too common here. It still kind of shocks me that even in a school like this, we still deal with these kinds of things. Tabisky is a career high school. They focus on their students' futures and it's a school of choice, and I don't think that their actions represent Dubisky very well at all. A Grand Prairie ISD spokesperson tells CBS News Texas that the video would be addressed next week when classes resume after spring break, and that I can assure you that we will fully investigate this situation and hold those involved accountable. Grand Prairie's NAACP president says the statement is insufficient. And I want the principal to be held accountable. And the teacher that was in that classroom, I want that teacher to be fired. I want the students that participated in the video to be suspended and removed from this school campus. The students we spoke with say watching the video was bad enough, but now it's even more troubling to read social media posts from their classmates defending it. Right now, under the comments of the post, people are speaking out saying it's normal, it's okay. These black students say the boys shown saying the N-word are all Hispanic and that school leaders should work harder to encourage the racially mixed student body to support each other on the same path to success. I know they can do it. I know our school can make change. I know, I believe in our school will do, will make change. I know they will. According to the state education code, the students could be sent to an alternative school or even expelled as a form of discipline if Grand Prairie ISD sees fit. J.D. Miles, CBS News, Texas.